spruce up my cheese pieces. I've done it before, but I think it's been a while. This is my first time trying this cheese cauliflower crust pizza. So this is how small it is. This is gonna be my snack for now and dinner for later. I might be the only one eating this, you guys. So I decided to come in here and share with you my first time experience of eating this cheese cauliflower crust pizza. Now this is my first time having holes at the bottom of a pizza pan. So when I did the other pizza for the family, I just made sure that I have foil on a rack in the bottom of the oven because I like to put lots of cheese and things like that. So right now, I'm just going to put it in as is and then I'm going to come back and show you when it's half done how I put the other cheese and the other seasons and thing on there. But for right now, part one. I'll see you in the next clip. Come right back. A few moments later. Okay, you guys, I'm back. This is what the pizza looked like so far. I didn't realize it had wood up under there, but that's what it looked like so far. So this is how I pre-cooked it. Now, the ingredients that I, I'm finna use is oregano leaves. This is just how I do mine. I switch the uh, ingredients up sometimes, you guys. I don't overload it with seasoning, but an all cheese pizza, honey, I wanna taste it, okay? black pepper so I hope you guys Wednesdays is going okay I've been uploading videos recording you know getting ready for my little trip you know just doing things okay next I'm going to add my cheese I wish I had I wish I had more of the uh, mozzarella provolone but I'm gonna use that and the rest of the four cheese Okay, first I'm going to put the Mexican for cheese. I hope you guys been enjoying my videos. I don't be having much to record, so I just said in order to keep active on my channel, not only do it's a hobby for me, but to keep active for you guys as well, I have to record what I do because I don't do much. So it may be little clips of stuff, you know what I'm saying? Not a lot going on, but something is better than nothing when you're trying to keep up with your YouTube channel, okay? Remember that. Something is better than nothing, guys. I'm not saying just throw anything out there just because, but sometimes that's all I got is a just because video, <laughs> like now. So I'm adding a mozzarella and provolone cheese to this pizza now, you guys. I'm liking the way the crust look already, see? Okay. So you guys, I'm just going to show a picture. I'm going to take a picture once, once it's done and show you what it looks like. And I'm going to leave it in the description down below and let you know how I like it. And, you know, will I purchase it again? So please make sure you check the description. All right. And I appreciate, I appreciate you guys for watching my videos, commenting, sharing. You guys been doing your thing, and I appreciate it. Okay, next, I'm using a little olive oil. That's what I like to use. I don't know, I'm just used to it, you know. I don't drown it with it. I just put a little on there, you know. Couple caps. I really like to put it around my edges, really. And just a little on here. I know that seems like a lot, but why front on how much I'm using, how much I like to use? Okay, it's what I like. There's my olive oil. Next, dry my hands off, ladies and gentlemen. I'm going to use some Pizza Hut crushed peppers, red pepper. Not a lot, but just enough to my liking. Of course, you put some to your liking. And last but not least, you already know, honey, the parsley flakes is a must. It just make it look pretty. Presentation is everything to me. Especially when it comes to my food. Okay, you guys. That's it. I will insert a clip once it's done. And remember to check down below in the description. And I will let you know how I like it. So, until the next time. You guys be blessed. 
please like comment and subscribe that way i know if you feel in my videos and i'll see you tomorrow you guys i'm doing a collab watch out for that video bye